you kill depending on the the hitbox you're getting so i think especially against an aerial character like once palms put herself in the air it can be hard for her to get out of the way in time yeah it almost kind of has uh some of the same uh intricacies that like marth into peach does right where it's like peach wants to be in the air but you can't defend yourself up there and same thing palm can get a lot of space from Sylve, but if Sylve's able to actually close the gap, then it's pretty terrifying to be in that position. Yeah, and we're, we're already seeing Foyda doing so much work here with pretty old shit. Um, you know, there, up there, pop up, and yeah, oh that's, my I was God. gonna say it's probably hit 12%, but uh, now we're not. We're back at zero because uh, Sylve back here will do that. Yep. So, really strong showing here for Heal's good already. Um, and a actually, really impressive pickup for that back here. Catching an F-top flower and knowing exactly where it's going to send. Mm -hmm. So, we're starting to see some openings here from half-step, but... So far, she's been struggling to... to match that level of damage output from Heal's Good, which is tough to do. Still if it's like a truck. Yes. The zoner that actually became a rushdown character. Yeah, but it's... exactly. Um, okay, good pickup there, recognizing that... Uh, once Sylph starts pinning off stage, like, you know, there's, he has a relatively limited number of options and has to have doing a great job recognizing, like, you know, this is my chance to, to find a kill. Oh, okay, got time to hang out, though. Yeah, and that's another strength that Palm has in this matchup. No kill so good at helping you cover every option when Sylph starts burrowing into the stage. Mm -hmm. cover, cover one spot with notes, cover another one with an actual attack, and then no matter what, you're getting the pickup afterwards. Right. And if you've got multiple notes, then you can just keep the combo going, because they help you reset. Yeah. Alright, not not quite getting the tech chase there, but Heal's Good continuing to put on a ton of damage, and really showing... Um, a lot of people forget, Sylv is a heavy, so you know, it doesn't feel like he's meant to be that fast. He does have one of the fastest run speeds in the game. Um, Does he have the second fastest? It's the second fastest. Yeah. Uh, which I did not know d until I started playing the character. Because uh, he yeah. just doesn't feel like he's a fast character. No. Um, but we're seeing in this set, like, you know, there's a lot of positions where Half Step is even retreating off stage because she's just getting overwhelmed by Heels Good being everywhere with these hitboxes. Oh, oh my, my god. God, what a bear. Incredible DI to live that bear. But that last stock was just a steam roll from uh, Heal's Good. That was so oppressive. Yeah, that is just I control the air. Uh, I control the ground and also I'm controlling the air because my hitboxes are huge. Yeah, exactly. You know, half step had to half step kept jumping and floating to get out of the way, and then now you've already burned your float and you're above Silva up air, so good luck getting down through that and Exactly. Literally never got a chance to touch the touch the ground after jumping that first time that stock. Yeah, I was half expecting one of those seeds to actually kill off the top. It's like, it's slowly pushing half step further and further to the blast down until she had really nowhere to go, but a, a straight shot down. Yeah. Uh, and so obviously the kill power, no problem on, on Sylve's end. I think half step may be hoping to, to even up how fast those kills are coming here on Rockwall, but in Sylve the Rockwall is also a scary proposition for a light character. So we might yeah. be seeing some purples well below 100. And Heels Good was making a lot of good use of flower movement as well. So all these platforms give you so many uh, places to position a flower to use your beast dash movement. Exactly. If you're threatening a beast dash, you're threatening a howl from the platform, setting up for a combo. Um, there's just so much utility you can get. And obviously also being able to do like uh, the rock wall platforms are a really close to tight to just immediately drop through the platform oh. and pin with bear. So yep. the movement is also incredible on the stage. but. We're seeing those tiny blast zones coming in huge for half step, taking that first stock with no issues. I need to get a little bit more movement, uh, a little bit more going. I love the the coverage there, um, you know, throwing out notes mid combo, and another one there on that platform, just making it difficult. Um, we saw he always had started the you know retreat to the platform, and there was a note just already in their way. Wait, nice yep, tech. Gotta be, gotta be ready for that tech. Uh, mm -hmm. Half-step clearly ready for it. Good edge cancel Wait, too, that, another follow-up out of the update. What a cheeky combo, I love that. That was, yeah, that was sick. Uh, was in finally seeing the Florida kill, but when you're getting a, you know, a Florida galaxy at 160 on rock wall, like, that is not where Sylv wants to be. Yeah. Um, especially now that we're seeing, you know, we're real close to kill percent here, if not already there. 
uh, yeah, that didn't quite do it, but another up smash like that will definitely kill Silva on this stage, so. Oh, nice um, try with the tech roll read. Looking for a comeback. Very interesting back air decision. I think reading it like a air dodge full in, but, um, yeah, heals good right now, he's looking to make a major play here. Yeah, that would have been huge damage if they got the read, but... Um, Half Step's doing yeah. a great job starting to actually recognize heal good's tech habits specifically. You see a lot of roll reads, like, yeah, just a lot of trying to cover no matter what tech option you go for, and also recognizing what those pokes are, mm -hmm. playing at that good range around town tilt. But unfortunately, it's still down to last stock here. Yeah, still down to last stock, and I mean, tons of damage coming out from heal good, but. Oh, and yeah, that grass still available. You see flowers just barely visible on that camera, keeping all the grass intact. Okay, not taking the bear, and one Florida not gonna do it, but a second one might. This is a scary position here for Pawn. Oh, Vince! So... <laughs> Take the shot, Vince! Please! Yeah. Get, get down, Save man. Save me! <laughs> exactly. Um, yeah, this is this is so scary. I mean, we're just seeing the damage oh output from Heal Good, God. and that's... I mean, just a huge comeback, right? Like, we saw a lead from Half Step almost that entire game, too, but... You know, pulling it back, no questions asked on that last stock. He was good advantage state, he's just brutal. Yeah, when we were talking about the pros for going to Rockwall 2, and uh, for Sylv anyway, one of the other things I was thinking about was like, oh, down smash as a, as a tech chase on the platforms. I did not think about down strong as a pickup off of Howl from the, oh, uh, yeah. from the ground. But yep. he was good, and, making and good use of that. And so light, that'll start comboing at pretty low percent. So great yep. usage there, but he was good. Um, and that brings us to another round two set, which is going to be Sunlust versus Jay Lindy. So we're finally getting some new some new matchups here. Uh, we're mm -hmm. getting Shovel Knight versus Maple, which should be a fun one. Opposite ends of the tier list, but 